Let's recover your hacked Google or Gmail ID without any recovery phone number or without any recovery email address. If you follow my step correctly, Google asks you how they can contact you, then you can give a new email address. Using that new email address, you can get a recovery link. Using that recovery link, you can easily recover your Google or Gmail password too. So you don't need to have access to any of your old recovery email or phone number. Before I jump into the video, I invite you to watch the full tutorial. In this video, basically I'm talking about how to recover it just using your default web browser as well as you can recover it just using one of your Google applications. If you want to learn about alternative recovery methods, I will put all the video links in the description. Since you are going to recover it just using our browser, open your default web browser. It doesn't matter which browser that on your mobile, select the default web browser. After that, go to search bar, then you have to type and search this word, Gmail recovery. Then you can get this kind of search result here, ignore the first search result as well as you have to ignore the second search result. Then you have to select third search result account support. If you couldn't find this, I will put the link in the description too. After selecting third result, you will get this login interface. Here they ask you to enter your email or phone number. First, enter your hacker email address. If you couldn't find your email address, just tap find my account. Then they will ask you to enter your first name and last name. After that, they will provide your Gmail address. After entering your Gmail address, tap the next button. After that, they ask you to enter your password. Here, since you don't have access to our password, you have to tap either forgot password option or try a different question. Select any of these, here I will select forgot password option, then they will provide all possible recovery method one after another. Here I invite you to or I recommend you to select at least one recovery method if you have access. Then you can get a verification code, using that verification code you can easily recover or reset your password. But unfortunately if you don't have access to any of these recovery method, all you have to do select try a different question like this then they ask to enter your full phone number here you can see the last two digits of your phone number here it doesn't matter your sim card is lost you can request a new sim card with the same number from your telecommunication service using that new sim card you can easily reset your password you can go through this recovery process multiple times so Try to get a new SIM card and reset your password. But unfortunately, if you don't recognize this mobile number or if you can't get new SIM card, in most case scenario, you have to tap try a different question option. After that, they will show you all email address. The first one, this is my current email address that I want to recover. The second email address is my recovery email address. This one is possible recovery method. If you already added some recovery email address, you can get a password reset code to that email address. Using that recovery code, you can easily reset your password and you can get a recovery code to your alternative email address if you have added it. But unfortunately, if you couldn't access your recovery phone number and recovery email address, all you have to do select try another way to sign in option at the bottom of the list. If you couldn't select any recovery method, you will get this error message, couldn't sign you in. Here they ask you to select at least one recovery method as well as they ask you to use a device that you signed into your Google account before. Here I invite you to select at least one recovery method or you, you can use a device that you previously logged into your Google account before like PC, notebook, laptop, whatever the device you can use a previous device. But unfortunately if you couldn't select any verification method or if you couldn't use any older device, I will show you simple trick to fix this error. Swipe down to the notification bar, again swipe down. Here you can switch between your networks. If you are using Wi-Fi network, you can switch to your mobile network. If you are using mobile network, you can switch to familiar Wi-Fi network like this. After that, you have to turn on your location permission. Then they can easily track your location. After that, it is better if you can restart your browser. After restarting, go to search bar. This time you type and search how to recover your Google account or Gmail. After that, you have to select the very first search result. 
how to recover your Google account or Gmail. Here they have added a new feature called recover your account using help desk. That option is still updating so I'm not using that option right now. Instead of using that option I will go for traditional recovery method. So scroll down and select recover your Google account or Gmail under forgot your password. So tap blue color link then it will be redirected to account recovery window. Here you have to enter your recovery email address like this. After entering your email address tap the next button. Then they ask you to enter your password. Since hacker has changed our password we don't know our password. So we can't provide our current password. So you have to tap try another way option in bottom left corner. Tap that option then you will be redirected to this window. Then they will provide another option to enter any last password that you use login to your Google or Gmail account previously. Here I highly recommend you to enter any last password that you used to log into your Google account before. After entering they will allow you to reset your password. But unfortunately if you don't remember any last password tap try another way option in the bottom left corner. Then you will get another question they ask you to how they can contact you. Now don't enter any old email address which you don't have access. Enter a new email address that you can access. Because all further verification and instruction and recovery links will be sent to this new email address. So enter new email address here. By the way, if you didn't get this option to add new email address, don't worry. There are alternative ways to recover your account and fix this error. You can find alternative ways and error fixing videos on my YouTube channel. And also I will put all the video links in the description too. So I invite you to go and check it out if this option is not available or if you got an error while recovering your account. Here enter your new email address that you can access. After that tap the next button. Then you will get this window. Here you have to verify this email address. To verify this email address they have sent a verification code to this new email address. So go back to your new email address then you have to check is there a new code. So I will minimize my browser then since I provide a gmail address I will open my gmail application. After opening if you refresh your email list you can see there is a new email from Google. If you open that email you can see there is a one time recurrent code. Like this I will open that then scroll down then you can see there is a verification code. You have to copy this code to clipboard. So take a long press on the code after that tap copy in the pop up window. Then it will be copied to your device clipboard. After that you have to go back to your browser. Like this swipe left then select your browser then tap enter code in the pop-up keypad tap on the code then that code will be pasted here or you can take a long press on enter code in the pop-up window you can tap paste like that somehow you can paste your code after paste it tap the next button after that you will get this kind of notice in my case I have to wait another 48 hours to get a recovery link but in your case most probably they will send a recovery link within next 6 hours. The reason behind that I try out this option multiple times. When you try it multiple times they will increase their recovery link sending time. So it is better if you can get a recovery link at the very first time. And also you can go through this recovery process multiple times. There is no limitation like Facebook. Then if you go to your new email address you can see there's a new email from Google. If you open that new email, there is a critical security alert. They will send a new recovery link to your new email address within next 48 hours. If you want to track your recovery process, check the status button in blue color. Then it will be redirected to a new window and you can track your recovery status. Then you will receive another new email from Google which is include recovery link to log back into your hacked Gmail account. Last email they told me it will take 48 hours. You can check the date of my new email. I got this recovery email with the same date. Most probably they will send a new recovery link within next 6 hours. After opening that new email tap the get started button. Then you will be redirected to your browser. Here it says welcome back. They could verify this account really belongs to you. 
so they allow you to update your password tap update password button here you have to enter your new password don't enter your old password create a new strong password here as well as you have to enter your new password twice after creating a new password tap the save button then you can log back into your hacked google account this is just a one way to recover your account there are multiple ways to get back your hacked account in some case if this method didn't work for you or if this option is not available for you, you can try out alternative methods. I will put other related video links in this video description. I invite you to go and check it out. If this method didn't work for you, definitely the other methods will work for you. So that's it for today's tutorial. See you in the next one. Later!